Yeah, that was BSOD, Blue Screen of Death. And the name of the hero is Inaccessible Boot Device. As you can see, the PC is restarting. It will repeat the same error. And if the PC runs for 24 hours, it will keep bringing the hero. The PC will never boot to desktop area. And what is the cause of this error? It is simply a bio settings. You see the hero is, is back. So in the BIOS, there's something called SATA operation. Okay. So after the PC restart now, we go to the BIOS. We're going to look at the SATA operation. So the BIOS, the BIOS is up and I'm going to where the SATA operation is. All right. So here's the SATA operation. And in this SATA operation, you know, there are three options. There's one, disabled. Number two is EECI. Number three is read on. Take, for example, if by the time OS is turned the PC, the SATA operation is set to EECI. Uh, maybe something along, along the line, something had happened, and the BIOS was reset. After the BIOS was reset, you know, it will load the default settings of the BIOS. So let's say the default settings of the BIOS is read on. And meanwhile, when OS was installed on the PC, it was set to EECI. It will keep bringing this error. And that is the cause of the error. That is it simply. So in order to have it resolved, you just have to change it to EECI. On this piece, I've changed to EECI. You are going to say that it's going to boot. Yeah. So that is, that's how to fix this kind of a problem. Another method to fix this kind of problem is just to restore the OS. So if you don't know which start operation, you can just, you try, if you try AACI, it doesn't work, try read on. It doesn't work, then try dis disabled. So if you try all the three options and the problem passes, know that the problem is not from the start operation. You have to continue with the troubleshooting and see where the problem lies. You see, it's back up. That is it.